Today we start with the question, how can I make a difference? And the Bible is very clear that the greatest difference you can make is leading someone else to Jesus. He's the one who changes everything. Now I know, that scares a lot of us, but I got thinking, why? And I think it's because we've made evangelism far too complicated. We've tried to make it a program, you know, four steps this, three principles that, or a clever argument, I'm right and you are wrong, or something a professional does, you know, bring them to church and they'll do it, or read a book. And now I'm not saying that those things are wrong. As a matter of fact, I think those things are incredibly helpful. My point is that they are not the key element in evangelism, because Jesus modeled a different way. Now it's true that he did answer questions in a brilliant way, and he took opportunities to formally teach people about the kingdom of God, but his greatest impact was, and I've already said it, proximity. The theological term is incarnation. It's what we celebrate at Christmas. Jesus chose to invest time, a lot of time, with people so that they could experience the Father through him. It was the fact that he wanted to be with people, no matter what their story or background, and that they wanted to be with him that opened the door to deep spiritual conversations. Like he didn't wait for people to come to him, for it was impossible for us to get to heaven. So he came to us and he was often found in places that quite frankly, the religious leaders did not like, but it was because that is where the people who needed him were. So I wanna liberate you today by challenging you to be like Jesus, by asking these questions, who is God put in your life? How intentional are you about the time you're spending with them? How willing are you to go to spaces that maybe make you uncomfortable in order to be light in the darkness? How open are you to taking opportunities to share what God is doing in and through you? Are you someone people wanna be with, to share their deepest stories with, to ask you for input? If not, maybe something needs to change. Because you see, evangelism is being so close to people that the God who has changed you rubs off on them. And that is a stepping stone to being who God has created you to be.